specially adapted equipment and 15 hours to make, but it is official. The record for the world's biggest samosa was broken in East London last night. Weighing in at 153 kilograms, a deep-fried treat was inducted into the Guinness World Book of Records after beating its predecessor, which was a mere 110 created at a mosque in Whitechapel by volunteers from the charity Muslim Aid. And I'm delighted to say I'm joined by one of them now, Fareed Islam. Um, Fareed, congratulations. First of all, you made it into the Guinness World Book of Records. Uh, Book World of Records. Um, tell me, first of all, it was very difficult to make, wasn't it? Because it's not something you do every day. What Believe did you have me. to do? Oh, when I in initially thought of the idea, I thought it's going to be quite simple. It's going to be something you do with four or five friends. <laughs> Only when Guinness World Records sent their criteria and the guidelines, uh -huh. Believe me, it was it was just it's beyond my means. Um, we had to bring in cranes. Uh, we had to take out a window to transport uh, the samosa. Wow. We had to build a five foot pot. We couldn't find a single pot in the country that was at that size. So yeah. it was actually 400 liters of oil. Um, it, it was absolutely crazy. Oh, we can see it now. Pictures. This is from last night. Look at the size of it. Exactly. You know, when when I was told that the record was 110 kgs, it only kicked in <laughs> when I was measuring and I was realizing that's about my weight. Yeah. Putting it into a samosa, no patient's going to hold that up. <laughs> I was, it was sort of, it was really dawned on me. I was like, how on earth am I going to do this? But luckily, with the, we had the specialities involved to support us. Big question everyone wants to know, of course. It's not here. That's because it's already been eaten. It, it didn't has, last it long. Has. Have you tasted it? What was it like? I tasted it. It was perfect. It's a traditional Indian recipe. Yeah. And we distributed it to the homeless people in London. Mm. Um, and the purpose behind that is we wanted Eid to be celebrated with not just the Muslims, mm. but our local friends, family. That's the essence of Eid, right? Your yeah. locality, your neighbours, to be, take part in this Eid celebration. Yeah, and listen, you've got your certificate here as well from Guinness. Let's have a look at it. This is to prove that it actually is a world record. It is. Pretty amazing. Excellent. Um, what if someone breaks the record though? What happens? You've got we'll to break it again. You've got I to make a you. <laughs> We'll break it again. <laughs> but uh, the, the, main, the main purpose behind this is to raise awareness about our, our um, campaign that yeah. we deliver across uh, 32 countries across the globe. Mm. 300,000 people this Eid would be fed by yeah. the donors, the British donors, um, through Muslim Aid. Well, that is wonderful. Listen, uh, Fareed Islam, uh, thank you so much for coming in to join me. It's thank a shame you. we didn't get to taste the samosa. Next time, I promise Next you. Next time. <laughs> All right, I'm going to hold you to that. Thank you so thank much. You.